integer bingo using addition and subtraction problems. This is the football version and this is a digital bingo game. The instructions are on slide 2. All of the problems you're going to call out to the students are on slide 3. So as you use each one just click and hold on the edge and move it to the right hand side. And that way you know which problems you've already used. At the end of the game, come up to the undo arrow, click it repeatedly, and everything goes right back into place. I give the students editing rights so they could scroll up and down until they find the bingo board that they want. I instruct my students to click in one of the chips and type their name or initials. And that way, uh, other students know that this board has been claimed and they need to find a different one. So as you're calling these out to the students, students are going to click and hold on a chip and they're going to move it to cover their answer. They're going to continue doing that throughout the game. As soon as they get five in a row, they can call out bingo. And if you want to check their answers, just have them move these chips to the side. And then you can check and see if they're correct. Now at the end of the game, the students can come up to the undo arrow, click it repeatedly, the chips go back into place, and their name comes off the chip. And that way, if you want to play again, they could scroll up and down and find a different bingo card and they could play again. So this is the addition and subtraction integer bingo game, the football version.